the activities will cover the entire space of Jamaica. Here and elsewhere. The six regions of the party will be very, very closely involved. We have a basket of choices for them. Dinners, concerts, family days, sports competitions, religious services, and bunny, even musical festivals. <laughs> We're going to ask the regions to bid for those events and to come up with any ideas of their own. We will also include specific participation from the arms, the youth organization, the women's movement, and the National Workers' Union, focusing on labor, on youth, and our women. We will not forget that one of our overseas groups, the Jamaica Progressive League, existed before the People's National Party. So they will be involved, as well as groups from New York, from Canada, from the United Kingdom, from wherever they exist. In all of this, the core values of the party which have served us so well and withstood the test of passing time must remain inviolate. The world has changed since 1938 and so has the makeup of the Jamaican society. We cannot ignore these changes. But our present circumstances require that the party must gear itself to meeting the challenges which presently confront us as a nation and externally, we must seek to build on our strengths as we chart a clear course for the future. In maintaining its brand, the PNP will mark this anniversary by a focus on attracting the best of our social forces as we rekindle the spirit of building a strong and resilient nation. And we are going to embark on a process of active recruitment from all sectors of our society. All the committees of the party will be involved, but the communications subcommittee, the outreach committee, the political education, they have already become energized and they will have to collaborate in a number of areas because this has to be done in a holistic fashion. Our desire is to foster debate within our groups. We must restore them to their original purpose as being a center for democratic political discussion on which the party is based and not just existing for electing people from time to time. We are going to engage fora within communities. We are going to involve sectoral groups as we define our mission for the next 25 years. One of these groups will be known as the Transformation Committee, and it will lead discussions within the party. It will include the broader society to prepare for the consideration and approval of party conference, how we advance our mission from here building on the progressive agenda and the manifesto for the last declaration to culminate in what we call Declaration 75. 
back. We must find new ways by which we promote social justice, equality of opportunity, and very importantly, sustainable economic growth. Some events which are already being planned include a reenactment of the launch of the party at the Ward Theatre. We're going to have an essay and poster competition. A special song has been commissioned to celebrate the occasion. We intend also to revive the tradition of honoring some from among our number for the singular contributions that they have made, including some who have lost their lives in the process, our martyrs. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This will take the form of updating the honor roll and we propose to establish a party museum. We are going to be launching a commemorative document which will reflect our role in the development of the political landscape in both the region and the world. There will be, as a high point, the National Gala Dinner to which a speaker of international renown will be among us. During annual conference, in addition to the normal pattern, special sessions and activities will allow associated political parties across the globe to make known their own commemoration of 75 years of progressive social and political leadership as we strive to achieve a more equitable global society for all the peoples of the world. We look forward to sharing these experiences with you as we retrace our steps that have guided our path to this crucial milestone. We are inviting your full engagement as members of the party as we reassess reawaken, re-engage and renew the relationship between ourselves and across and throughout the society here in our homeland and across our diaspora.